Aries, something's coming to an end this week, heralding great change in your life and signaling the end of an era. There may be some feelings of sadness or reluctance to let this happen, but rest assured that it is leading you to something better, your heart's desire and the kind of life you've been seeking. So you need to stop worrying about all of the things that you should have, could have, would have done and stop feeling guilty about anything you've done in the past that you're not proud of so that you can start moving now towards what you've long been wishing for. The past and any mistakes you've made are now behind you and the time has come to begin again. Knowing what you want will help you find a way to achieve it and regain a sense of freedom when you break the bonds that have been binding you for too long now and start getting life moving again. So stop overthinking things and let go of all that is no longer serving you by releasing old patterns that have dominated your thoughts and emotions so that you can stand in your truth and find a better reality. A new relationship or a new beginning to an old one will see you feeling better overall and if you've been in conflict with someone, now's the time to start looking for a reason to forgive them or to ask for forgiveness. If you've been struggling with two choices, now's the time to start making some decisions. But overall, this is a period of bonding and life is going to get better. An air sign or more manipulative woman in your circle may make it easier to make these choices as you find yourself at a crossroad, reflecting on how you got to where you are at the moment and where you are heading to now. Taurus, a water sign or more nurturing male in your circle will help you to take control over the direction that things are heading in in your life this week, where you have previously felt quite controlled, and this will see you starting to believe in yourself again for the first time in many months. You have been feeling restricted on many levels, but a new beginning is coming, creatively or intimately, and this will bring about a feeling of victory over all that has troubled you, propping up your waning self-esteem. Underlying issues within your family and it will come up to be addressed and this will see you assessing what it is that you really want from your life as your passion starts building and you once again start seeing how you might make your life work for you. The time has come for you to strike a balance between work and play, moving forward without being rigid or inflexible about how things should work and understanding that much of what you've worried about is never actually going to happen. Gemini, this week sees you focusing on what you want from your life and reveling in newfound sense of freedom. As you break the bonds that have binded you, whether physical, mental or emotional, and move on to a new period of growth and happiness. You may have been feeling emotionally fragile on levels, and you should feel free to express your feelings openly, but take this time also to start venturing out and feeling things more deeply, as life is about to get better for you and success is all around you in whatever direction you're choosing to go in. For too long you've cut yourself off from the world and from anyone you feel has the ability to hurt you, but the time has come for you to look at the past and accept the truth in regard to your part in all that has happened to you, so that you can accept the lessons related to this and move on from them. A logical approach to things is the best way to effect lasting changes, and embracing the difficulties of your past whilst accepting them as things sent to test your mettle will see you prevailing and becoming stronger and more resilient as a result. You may be having trouble with a child or young person in your life who may be struggling with something on a mental or emotional level and they really need your support at the moment, no matter how much they seem to be fighting against it. Look beyond the obvious in regards to these troubles as all is not what it seems and you will need to dig deeper if you are going to find the core problem, but once you do so you will gain a much deeper understanding of how this person ticks and this will allow you to embark upon a whole new beginning with them. A new start is coming to you on all levels and this will include the return of someone or something to your life. Celebrate the past, then prepare to move on to something new, as a new beginning opens up to you emotionally, bringing happiness with it. Cancer. This week sees you focused on practical matters and making your investments, whether physical, mental, emotional or financial, work for you, so that you can get the outcomes you're seeking with things, and this will require a very logical approach. Family's in focus and there is a sense of harmony or the possibility to create it if it has been lacking, so that you can finally start to feel without a shadow of a doubt that all in your life is as it should be. There's something you've been procrastinating about or running away from, then the time has come for you to face it and do what needs to be done to resolve it, and doing this will lift a great weight from your shoulders, particularly where you've been stubborn just for the sake of it. A new beginning is coming for you on an emotional level and if you need to forgive someone, now's the time to do it letting your feelings show so that you can find inner peace and let go of any anger towards them. You may have felt for a time now that you've been wandering somewhat aimlessly and the time has come wherein you need to find your way back to your path. 
Using your intuition will help you to get to where you need to go as you begin to recall the vastness of your potential and remember the unlimited possibilities that you hold within yourself and then call on these as you step out into a new beginning. Leo, if you've been in a period of conflict in your life just lately, this week sees you needing to show some self-restraint so that you can work towards some kind of compromise with the other party as nothing's going to be resolved until you back down a little. An air sign or more logical man in your life will help you to see things more clearly and this will prove helpful, opening you up to a new beginning emotionally that will lead you to a gift of some kind. If you need to forgive someone or to be forgiven, then now is the time to sort this out, so use your intuition to look beyond the obvious surface situation to what is obscure and hidden from view. An opportunity is coming for you for a project of some kind that you will be undertaking with others. Be sure to prepare for your part in this properly as it may prove more involved than it initially might seem and going in half-cocked will see you doomed to failure. If there's something you've been running away from, whether a commitment of some kind, responsibility, hard work or the love, the time has come for you to turn and face it as continuing to run is only going to make things worse for yourself. Virgo, life starts out feeling good this week as you sit back on your haunches and look at all the positive elements around you that seem to be working in harmony and start to see the light at the end of what may have been a fairly long tunnel. If you're making plans, back them up with work and effort as now's the time to tighten up your life and commit yourself to doing what it takes to reach your goals. A water sign or more nurturing woman around you will soon make you an offer of some kind which has real potential but will require hard work and you may feel stressed out at the thought of it. You may also be holding on to guilt over the way that you've been treated in the past, but holding on to this will only make you feel more stuck, so either deal with the feelings and confront the related issues, or accept what has passed cannot be changed and let it go, taking only the lesson along with you. The most recent phase of your life is about to come to an end, so put the past and its mistakes behind you, because however bad you think things have been, there's always someone worse off than you are, and dragging your baggage around will only continue to create problems for you that are not going to prove productive in the long term. Libra, this week sees you longing for freedom on some level and yearning to break the bonds that are binding you physically, mentally or emotionally, so that you might move on to a new period of growth and happiness where you've been feeling that something is missing. If there is a situation in your life right now that needs handling, resist the temptation to let others do that for you and take matters into your own hands as this will see you accomplishing what you've set out to do despite any irritations that seem to keep cropping up and without the interference of those around you who would rather you don't succeed. Life is about to start coming together so you can feel connected and engaged with what is all around you and truly thankful for all that you have in your life. Career or financial difficulties may need to be addressed before this can happen but don't focus on feelings of lack, as these won't be long-lasting. Instead, move quickly to do what is necessary to get your life going again in these areas, even if it means taking some risks. Much of what you're worried about is never going to happen, so don't worry if things seem to be falling apart on some level, but you do need to watch that you don't form harmful patterns during this time that might lead you to addiction or self-destructive behaviours. Examine your situation carefully to make sure that you are making the best choices as even a small change can make all the difference. If you are feeling guilty for past mistakes, the time has come to let them go and start moving forward in the knowledge that you now know what, what not to do in the future. Approach things from a logical perspective whilst at the same time avoiding the temptation to overthink your situation and bring an end to all in your life that's no longer serving you so that you might then be free to take on new opportunities as they arise. Scorpio, changes are coming into your life thick and fast this week, all designed to test your mettle, and it's important that you embrace the lessons they are settling out for you and meet the associated challenges, or that you give the appearance that you are, even when you're not too sure about it. Creativity is on the rise this week, and you may find yourself getting stuck into some projects that you've been putting off for a while, opening up and expressing yourself emotionally, as you have needed to do for some time. Look for ways in which you can begin connecting with others if you haven't in a while. And if you have someone in your life who needs forgiveness, then now's the time to set aside any bad feelings and give it, or to ask from it, from those who you feel you have wronged. 
A time of emotional freedom is coming for you as you break any bonds that have had you bound up and move on to a period of growth and happiness. A change of direction will guide you onto a path of adventure, wonder and personal growth and you must believe now that anything is possible as you step out fearlessly into new areas. A new relationship or a new beginning to an old one will help you to find a sense of connection in your life that you may have been missing for a time. If you've been fighting with someone, look for an opportunity to call a truce and the chance to forgive or to be forgiven. And if you've been struggling with choices, seek to reconcile them, taking a logical rather than an emotional approach. You can have the stability you've been seeking by tying up loose ends and making firm plans for your future. And an earth sign or grounded man in your life will help you to achieve this, much to the dismay of those who would like to see you fail. Small irritations will have you feeling controlled to some extent, but it's important that you don't allow your worries to overwhelm you and that you don't allow yourself to feel guilty over things that can't be changed. Sagittarius, changes are coming in for you this week and if you've been struggling with a problem or tough situation, standing back a little from it will help you to see things from a different perspective. Stop pretending that all is okay if it isn't and acknowledge your feelings instead standing in your truth as you do so, so that you will then be in a better position to tackle anything you aren't happy with, rather than playing the martyr. Rest assured that you have gone as low as you are going to go, and life is about to start looking up, but this means focusing on yourself and your needs for a while, and restoring your emotional balance without worrying too much about what other people might think of you for doing this. Peaceful times are coming, so look for any opportunities to bring parties that are opposing in your life together. Where illness has been a problem, things may start looking up, but this will happen when you take control over the direction you're heading in, even if you have to take some risks. Trust in your own creative potential and there will be no end to what you can achieve, as this is a chance for you to be original, to take action and to push forward towards what is in your life that you really want, bring an end to all that is no longer serving you, even if you feel a little sad at first letting go. Capricorn, this week sees you focused on the future, making plans so that you might start moving towards a long-term goal, but Spirit is reminding you that this does not need to be done alone, and that you might actually find that you'll be more productive if you pull your resources with others and allow them to help you, even if it's only with the planning stages. You may have been feeling overwhelmed just lately, but rest assured that there's a light at the end of the tunnel, and the time is coming where you must open your heart to what lies ahead and release any fears or doubts. If you've been holding back on any level, now is the time to give generously of yourself and your resources, taking positive action to get to where you're wanting to go. Changes are coming in and some of these may bring challenges designed to test your mettle. Meeting such challenges will make you stronger and more resilient, though you may not appreciate this whilst you are going through them, especially where conflict with a child or young person is concerned. A logical approach will work best in relation to any difficulties you're experiencing, though you may not always appreciate the directness of the responses you might get. Look at what's being said, however, before you react to it, and weigh out the truth in many remarks, no matter how hurtful they might seem at first, so that you have a better chance of cutting through the chaos and seeing things clearly rather than just reacting to any barbs or arrows. Aquarius, this week sees you needing to use your intuition in order to look beyond the obvious in your situation so that you might see what is hidden and obscure and know when to act and when it might be best to hold back a little. Opportunities are about to come knocking and it's time for you to push beyond your limits of what you may have thought possible, seizing the initiative to become the best that you can be in whatever area you choose by being original. An end is coming to the way life has been for you and this means that you'll be able to put any mistakes you've made in the past behind you and start again in a better way. An earth sign male will be helpful during this time as he eases your mind of any worries you have and offers solutions to problems. You may be holding on to some guilt over something you've done or something you feel you should have done but this will not serve you so take the lesson it's given you and let go of the rest so that you can move forward making better choices in the future. Question how you have come to find yourself in the position you're in at the present. And if you don't like it, then do something to change things rather than allowing yourself to move forward as the victim. The time has come to stop focusing on what you think you don't have in your life and start looking at all that you do have.
Pisces, this week sees you working with a group of people to get something done, and so long as you prepare for the task and organise it properly, all will go well, as this is something that's meant to be. The time is upon you to try something new, so that you might pull yourself out of the rut you've been stuck in, and get your life moving, and this will see any health issues you've struggled with improving as well, as a new beginning opens up for you creatively or intimately. An air sign or more forthright woman in your life will give you strength to keep moving forward, where you may otherwise feel stuck. And this will see you beginning to make long-term plans for your future, even when things are not going the way you want them to. You may have an impulse to learn something and develop new skills, or to tie up loose ends on an existing project, so that you might stand back and admire all that you've achieved. Now's the time for you to seek out pleasure and enjoy yourself, but this will mean making choices and decisions that you may struggle with at first. Making these will lead you to a balanced outcome, however both physically and financially, pushing you into a period of fun, laughter and good times.